Welcome to a video from the Digital Lifestyle.com, new Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 18262. This is for Windows Insiders on the fast ring and using the skip ahead option. And this is a 19H1 build, 19H1 being uh, 2019 H1 half half year, first half of next year that it's going to be released. Um, so it's been a couple of weeks since we've had a build and uh, just a few things to show you in this build. In Task Manager, it's now DPI aware it shows the applications that have got DPI awareness. So there's the option I can add that. And then that shows you each application, that's the task that's running on, on its DPI awareness. A couple of other things with this build is you can uninstall some of the inbox apps. Inbox apps are apps that ship with Windows 10. So for example, calculator, you can uninstall that. You couldn't do that in the previous build. Uh, the same with mail, um, movies and TVs, Paint 3D, Snip and Sketch, Sticky Notes, Voice Recorder and uh, 3D Viewer, the application that was called Mixed Reality Viewer. So you can now get rid of these uh, which you couldn't do before. So a new setting is this recommended troubleshooting uh, which should automatically detect and fix issues. So if there's an issue that, um, that Windows can help you get up and running then it will be in that, um, it will automatically prompt you and gives you the recommended troubleshooting and you can turn that on and off here so you notice in mine it's already switched off I'm not quite sure why that is maybe because there isn't anything to troubleshoot I'm not quite sure yet some of the other uh, changes they fix some mysteries with app history in task manager and the task manager icon they fix some issues with uh, upgrading the builds and uh, some settings application, uh, some settings, things they fixed as well, a new language setting. So another change that Microsoft uh, say on release notes is some insiders may notice some changes to clipboard history, more details later. Well, I think that looks the same actually, I've just put some text onto the clipboard, maybe there's something new coming with that, I know that SwiftKey in integration is coming, so on Android you can pick up with, you can get that clipboard text, so I'm not quite sure whether that's just going to be doing a bit of A-B testing so some people get it, some people won't, or it's not ready yet. Uh, there's a couple of known issues, uh, settings may crash in certain pages, um, some issues may, some users may have issues launching inbox apps such as the Microsoft Store. I did get this on my pre on the previous build and the only way to fix it was a bit of uh, PowerShell and that looks like it's working okay so looks like it's not affecting me at the moment. Uh, switching endpoints may um, it doesn't work, you can't do that from here, audio endpoints I should say. I'm not going to do that now because my uh, recorder is running but if I switch that from there that doesn't work currently. And uh, task view fails to show the plus button under the new desktops after creating two desktops. So those are the changes with this build, all fairly minor changes. Uh, we're still quite early in the development of 19H1. Uh, uh, the Redstone 5 is just about to go back out again after it was uh, delayed or pulled because of the uh, deletion bug. More on the digitallifestyle.com, our YouTube channel, and at iSticks on Twitter. Thanks for watching.